Hello guys, good afternoon. Um, so this is the instructional video for your session 17. This is going to be a pre-recorded class uh, every Thursday. Okay, so I, I wanna keep it short just to give you, um, so all the materials and resources um, are already uploaded to the campus. So go and check the materials, please don't skip any of them because those are very important. Uh, but I wanted to give you some instructions in case we were kind of lost, like where to go next. So this video is for that reason, uh, hold on. So basically what we're doing here, it's, let me just give you the instructions for today's lesson. Okay, so the first thing that you are going to find is the instruction that make sure that it says class 17, and then make sure that you're ready competence for today's class, as well as the instruction, and usually that this is what we have for the instruction. But in this activity section, you already have uh, the space for your attendance. Um, and you have the, the this, this activity. And this is going to be the main activity for today's session, uh, which is a, a transcendentalism form. So in, in terms of transcendentalism, you're going to have a video, I think tomorrow I'm going to upload it on Friday. It's going to be available on Friday. So you can go back and check the video. And I, I'm going to expand a little bit uh, the, the specific topic of transcend, transcend, transcendentalism. So tomorrow the, it's going to be this, uh, this video available, um, but you can start working on, on this. And then the supporting materials the, in this section, Material de Pollo, Basically what we have is uh, two videos. And, and for today's session, we cover two things. Uh, the first one is um, transcendentalism and transcendentalism through the eyes of David Thoreau, uh, Henry David Thoreau. Um, you wanna know a little bit more about David Thoreau. So this is the video you gotta watch. So it's gonna help you to understand better the next video that is going to be me developing the topic, all right? that is going to be available tomorrow. So tomorrow you should, you should come back to the campus online or you can watch it on Saturday or Sunday or Monday or Tuesday, Wednesday, even next class, right? So it's gonna be available for you there to study and comprehend a better the thematic of um, the topic of um, transcendentalism. And this one, it's about Walden, uh, Walden by David Thoreau, that is the work and that is explained um, this video is similar to the one from the Scarlet Letter. So it gives you an explanation and a summary and an analysis of the book Walden, all right? Let me know if you wanna, first, firstly, I wanna, I wanted to share with you the audiobook for today's session, uh, today's session, the Walden, but it's way too long. And I don't know if you're able or capable or willing to, um, you know, like listen to an audiobook that is very long. But in case you are, please text me and say, Mister, I would like to to listen to the audiobook that is Walden by Henry Thoreau, which is very ex, um, existential and philosophical. And it's it's you know, it's very nice if you want to have like you want to impress someone about like your lifestyles and a very good uh, topic of conversation. Walden's ideas are very nice. And this is a very well-known guy in the United States. So if you wanna know about someone in the United States, it's about um, Thoreau and Rolf Waldo, all right? So those two ideas to keep in mind. So after watching this video and after watching this other video that is a complementary and supporting material, there is the nature part. And this is a PDF Hopefully, guys, it's, it's sharing this part. So it's a PDF, it's two pages long. That is uh, an excerpt of um, Ralph Waldo Emerson. Um, that is the, the guy that we previously studied. So this is two pages for you to read. And it's important that everybody reads these two pages because um, it's gonna help you to understand and to answer some of the questions in the, in the trans, uh, transcendentalism form. All right, so read this. So, and then after watching this video and this video and reading this uh, PDF, 
you go in to the activity section and then you click on transcendentalism. And this is going to help uh, give you the instructions. So this is uh, an activity, a group activity. And the first thing that you gotta do is you gotta organize yourself as a color based group. So if you're team yellow, team blue, team red, that's the group that I work working on. All right. Second thing you gotta do is um, check the guiding questions and discuss them as a group and gather opinions and consolidate one uh, group answer. So you are going to have the, the guiding questions in a couple of seconds, but what you gotta do is like read, find the answer, discuss and consolidate only and to have on, in order to have only one um, answer for each question as a group, all right? And the third thing you gotta do, uh, the leader of the group, it's the only person the only person of the group that is going to submit, submit all, submit, um, submit all of the um, answers to the to, to this form. So for uh, per group, I only need one answer, and the person that is going to um, upload and submit the answer is going to be the leader of the group. All right. So one more time, only the team leader must submit the answer. That's Pay attention to that. And you gotta let me know which session does your group belong, if it's a group A or group B, uh, and what is the color of your group, and what is the model of your team, and list the name of the students who are part of your group, full names. For example, in these cases, uh, the first thing is uh, Fabricio Ulises Chavarria Arias, comma, Juan Pedro uh, Baltasar Villalobos, comma, like, I don't know, and then you go, um, to the, all of the members of the group in this section. All right, then you go next. And then in here, you don't have to do anything but reading and comprehend. Uh, this is a little bit like a background to have an idea of what we're talking uh, in here, transcendentalism. And in this section, it's transcendentalism. Uh, that is the second task. Um, and then you are going to decide as a group, do you find comfort in nature? Do you reflect the moods of nature? Um, of course, hell no, or maybe, all right? That's the only thing, select one. What is the role of nature in your life? And then you're going to decide as a group, only one um, answer, but after discussing as a group, right? Is there a connection between the individual spirit in nature? If so, what is the connection? Is there any, yes, no, why? How do you demonstrate that you are an individual? Do you think independently of others or do you follow the crowd? After discussing as a consensus, you can consolidate the answers and let me know what is the, the answer from your group. And that is the second task, very simple. This one, it's the one that you need to read the, the material that is nature, the two pages of the PDF in order to have a better understanding, right? But you can go on, on Google and research not the answer to the question, but like to the content in the background, right? And it says, what different mood does Emerson note in the excerpt? And in the instruction says, read and discuss the excerpt from Emerson Nature, the one that I uploaded. And then you're going to answer these questions. And then you submit as a group. Only the leader is going to submit the answer. Is it clear? Let me know, please. I'm going to be um, waiting for your answers. And then once you finish this, I created something that probably you like it, probably you say, oh no, this is so disgusting. I created this activity for you to interact and I wanted to share. Um, so this activity is basically a, a, a couple of music and I want, to, I want you to understand the concept of romanticism and transcendentalism through music. And I added some of your, some, some, um, some songs and lyrics and music videos, and they are organized by genre. So if you prefer to go up to all of them, so click on here. And then if you prefer only, but I created the oldies in classic category, and then there is a pop rock and there's R&B and rap and there's uh, country music. So you're going to see uh, the definition of transcendentalism and romanticism basically in this music and this, um, expressed in these songs, all right? So we have the first one, that is What a Wonderful War. Probably you're familiar just the way you are by Billy Joel, which is, and honestly guys, uh, this kind of music is my kind of music. So um, 
so I wanted to share at the same time, like this, the, the songs that I listen in the different genres and, but they're related to the music that it's um, individualism, nature, God, philosophy of God, but not God as, as, a, as a gospel, but God as an individual person creation. Um, the idea of deism, the enlightenment, individualism, and not collectivism. So all of that is reflected in these ideas. Uh, so probably you're familiar with some of the songs and you can like, you know, at the same time you're completing the discussing the ideas uh, with your group, you can play the, this playlist. And then you have the, the, the section that is for the R&B and rap. And then you have the country uh, music that I usually listen to. So this is for you only to interact and to comprehend better through a culture, uh, pop culture uh, and music, the concept of transcendentalism and romanticism. Hopefully guys, you like this activity. And in the Gazette, I'm going to, I'm going to open a Gazette. So if you're interested to comment in the Gazette, right now I'm going to open a Gazette for you to let me know which is one of your, if you wanna share, uh, name of songs that are related with the concept of romanticism and transcendentalism. And if you make a suggestion for the group, so you should listen to this song, for example, um, Survivor, that it's one of the by Destiny Shall, and it's the idea of individualism and empowerment and the power of the self and the consciousness of, of the person. So you can just share. Um, some suggestions for music that is not any kind of music, but music that it it reflects the thematic of romanticism. And you know that romanticism is not everything about love, but it's about the connection, you know, the definition of romanticism and also with transcendentalism. So if you want to make suggestions in the cassette section, I'm going to open a discussion of a discussion over there. Thank you very much. Enjoy the class and tomorrow there is going to be one extra video for you that is going to be the explanation. You can watch the video at any time. So it's for you to understand better the definition of transcendentalism. But with these ideas, activities for today, you have enough. And everything is going to be discussed for next class that is going to be next Thursday, Thursday. Not Tuesday, because on Tuesday you have you already have one activity. So yes. Thank you. Bye. Take care.